Hey everyone, Nick Cohen here from the Hyperactive Bookworm. Here to do another in the car book review. So I finished listening to Princess Floralinda and the Forty Flight Tower. So this was written by Tamsin Muir. And listening to it was just fabulous because the best combo in the world is Tamsin Muir, narrated by Moira Quirk. So I love Moira Quirk. Her narration is just so fantastic. The sarcasm, the dry humor that is Tamsin Muir's writing is just captured so perfectly, so perfectly by Moira Quirk. So this book is sort of like a twisted retelling of, um, of Rapunzel. And it is freaking hilarious. So a few gory, gruesome bits, but you know, very, um, very tongue in cheek sort of aspects. We get all different kind of mythical creatures. Um, we get uh, a fairy who is just unimpressed with her lot in life. We get this whole idea of what makes someone good and what makes someone bad. We get this, this whole twist idea of, um, fighting for your life and fighting because you want to it's kind of fun and challenging and the amount of times I laughed in this book was just absolutely insane um but yeah it was so much fun it's a quick read and I absolutely loved it Tamsin Muir's writing is just absolutely fantastic I love her voice in her writing um it, it seems very telling of sorts, but I don't know. There's just some something about the way she writes. I just swoon and dive into it all. And yes, I had to listen to this because I'm in craving, craving for the next um, book in the Lock Tomb series. So I think I'm going to have to go back and re-listen to all of them. To Gideon the Ninth, uh, Harrow the Ninth, Nonna the Ninth, waiting for this last book and I cannot freaking wait. So, but definitely check this out. Fun, twisted retelling of Rapunzel and yeah, I'd love to hear other people's opinions on this book because I had so much fun with it and it was awesome to have that kind of lighter book thrown in amongst all these heavier ones I'm reading at the moment. <laughs> so yeah, go check it out. Thanks y'all.